What makes a good teacher or a good teaching assistant? Is it that they make difficult things easy to understand? That they make classes and labs enjoyable? Is it that they make labs memorable? All of these things are nice, but ultimately a good teacher is one that helps each student learn as much as they can. Some people think that at university level and when dealing with science and engineering, the teacher doesn't make that much difference to how much student learns. That the job of the teacher or the teaching assistant is to explain things and that students who are bright or hardworking will learn and others won't. In fact, the research evidence suggests differently, and a major review of studies published in 2014 found that, on average, students in classes where teachers used evidence-informed teaching methods scored higher and fail less than students taught in more traditional ways. So, what are these evidence-informed teaching methods? And what do they look like in practice if you were a teaching assistant in a science or an engineering program? That is the question that this MOOC is designed to answer. I'm Roland Tormey, I teach learning sciences in EPFL and I've worked in training teachers for over 20 years. I'm Cécile Ardebol, my background is engineering and computer science. I've been teaching in different engineering schools and I work with EPFL teachers on innovation projects in teaching and learning. I'm Ingrid Leduc. I'm a social psychologist and for over a dozen years I teach, train and coach teachers on pedagogical issues in higher education. If you're interested in what teaching assistants can do to help students learn in labs, exercises and projects, then this MOOC is for you.